you were going to say coming to understand the 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 process of creation which we we started out speaking about the spiral so we have this this emotion which is the same thing as our vibration which fluctuates up and down the spiral all the time mm. polarity is the thing that is drawing us up and down this virtual vibrational spiral and polarity exists to deliver a mix of positive and negative experiences in our lives this is why you can learn about law of attraction and positive thinking and still not manifest everything that you want mm. and still have problems because mm. life is not perfect and we are not racing toward perfection because if we achieve perfection we will cease to be there's no point in in, in physical being other than expansion and the expansion is delivered through the experiencing of positive and negative so every time we experience something negative we have an opportunity to raise our vibration where all the solutions are when we're up in that good feeling place things get solved very easily have you ever noticed that you have a problem there's something that you're working on and you just can't get it it won't work you know you're you're trying to figure out something on your computer or in your business and you step away from it for a little while you know maybe you just go have lunch go do something that is enjoyable just because you can't take it anymore then you go back to it and you solve it and it just solves so easily and you think gosh you know why couldn't i get this before it was so easy well it's because you went and raised your vibration and the solutions to everything mm. every problem in life is in higher vibration mm. this is why anger and fear and resentment and all of these lower vibrational things our reaction to our problems at best is a step one reaction and the reason that we see so many problems that don't get solved that keep coming back again and again and again in our lives mm -hmm. and for humanity as a collective is because we go into that anger space and we're angry about something we see this right now i'm in the united states and we have all these protests going on and mm -hmm. we get into this space of anger and we stay in anger Mm -hmm. And then eventually polarity pulls us out of anger naturally. And then we're out of anger. We want to feel better. And it's easier to just forget about that thing and move on from it and not be angry about it anymore. It's a, it's a coping mechanism to just kind of forget about it. Let's forget all about that. And that's why we have the same problems, not just the United States, but everywhere that keep recurring over and over again for decades mm -hmm. and don't really get solved because we stay in step one of anger. But well, we can apply that in our lives as well. Mm -hmm. So we have the problem of whatever it is, you know, a, a, a chronic illness or not enough money or being in jobs that we don't like or abusive relationships or no relationship, whatever it is that you're looking to change, as long as you're in that low vibration, resentment, anger, fear, vibration, you're going to keep that thing recurring in your life mm -hmm. until you move on to a higher vibrational perspective of it and allow the solution to flow in. That is the key to solving any problem in life, regardless of what it is.